Okay, this is my journey for departing. Okay, that's where my room is. Uh, it's uh, not exactly in a state where I can show you at the moment. So I start from from that position instead of from the side. Cambodians out playing. Hey, yeah. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Classmates. Yeah. Hello. My neighbour. Really nice guy. And who's this? Hey, yeah. Somebody's in trouble. Basically, uh, the Laotian student, Wei Kai, seems a nice guy. Apparently, he's been in trouble for uh, for being a bit too a bit too closely addicted to the bottle. Apparently, he was caught drunk. Hey, Dutch guy, he's all right. Hey. Uh, the new new guy from Colombia is apparently absent from class for one week, and uh, Shin Taekwun, the Korean guy, has been warned a second time for uh, for absence from class. <sighs> Never happened uh, last semester. The semester before. Music's always different on a Friday. Oops. Third movement has just concluded. Well, it's kind of still going. Second movement's always most busy, but it's the Iraqi lad. He's just come out of class, I guess. He's probably heading to the uh, to the halal restaurant at the uh, at the top of the hill. <coughs> Thai people. Somebody taking a picture. Think about it, it's not actually all that busy. If it was, I'd have to walk in the road. Because people would be everywhere and they wouldn't let me through. Hey, yeah. Ah, chit chat. Ah. Mongol guy, he's very nice. Wow. <laughs> Weather's bad today, so no basketball boys. Oh, hang on, no. There are. There is one. 
One all on his own. One all on his Todd. There's people passing through. Hello. Nice parking, mate. It's raining, so it's a bit slippery, so you've got to pay attention. Don't know whose bright idea it was to put bathroom tiles on the pavement. It just makes, makes it very dangerous when it's wet. Always if it's been a rainy day, and the next day, oh, Xinjiang person here. Someone from Xinjiang province. Um, um, yeah, always the day after a rainy day, you always get at least one or two people limping because they've slipped over. Stupid design. Where they make such uh, low friction pavements. That's something about Britain. This is something about a Swiss chocolate company. <sighs> ah, the purple tree has been wrapped. In the, in the summer, this is covered with purple flowers. And the uh, big black butterflies um, visit, visit it often. They're big and black and they look like bats, but they're butterflies. So I call them batterflies, because I don't know what else to call them. Archie invited me to some sort of event, ethnic event, taking place there tomorrow. Teacher te tend to get ready for a like, um, Christmas performance, but I don't know what to do for Chris the Christmas performance uh, this time. Last year I... Let's see, what did I do? Ah, reciting poems, yes. The Chairman Mao's uh, famous uh, snow poem. And uh, Xu Jin was um, uh, leaving Cambridge again. Uh, yeah, that, that second poem is unusual in that it. Uh, Chinese poem by a Chinese poet, but it's about Cambridge. It's about you know his experience in Cambridge, about leaving Cambridge, and uh, also it's not in the classical Chinese language. It's in the it's in the the vernacular, which is unusual for for uh, you know for Chinese poetry. Usually it's in a you know poetic form. You know an eight. You know, it's dangerous crossing here. Sometimes there's. Oh, is that? Yes, yeah, Jima. Oh no, it's not. Uh, no, it's the. Uh, it's the American spies. They know just what China's weakness is. There are millions of, of, uh, of Chinese who are very, tens of millions of Chinese who are extremely naive and will believe anything. Many of them are also uh, very dissatisfied with the government. 
They feel that society has let them down, and these Americans give them a message of hope. And in so doing, they gain their loyalty. I've told many Chinese people about this, but most people don't believe it's a threat. You see, one thing about China is that um, it's, you know, the Chinese are very good at reacting to threats when, when they spot them. But they cannot react to that which they do not know is a danger. Sometimes I fear that uh, they will react too late to do anything. And all this, all this will be gone. There she is. One of them. Oh, hang on. Yeah, this is, this is where I eat most days. Dumplings. It's busy. Ah, love it.